Hi, my name is Deb Barron and I'm here to tell you all about the social science department. Uh, I head the social science department and uh, following on from me will be a series of video clips from the tutors that deliver the suite of A-level um, subject areas that we cover. Um, they'll be telling you a bit about the content of the courses, which is particularly useful if they are courses that you're not familiar with from GCSE. In addition to that, though, I would just like to tell you about two exciting new courses that we've also got on offer at Selby College in the Social Science Department. They are Applied Psychology, which is a national extended certificate in psychology and would suit those students who are perhaps fascinated by psychology, but a bit um, concerned about terminal assessment and exams as there is more of an emphasis in the um, extended certificate on coursework. Uh, similarly, we've also got an applied diploma in criminology and criminology draws on elements of the legal system but also um, psychology and sociology um, and many students are considering studying this alongside the psychology and sociology or other uh, subjects as well of course. So I hope you find the presentations informative and interesting um, and thank you for listening. Hello, I'm Eddie Sanderson. I teach A-level Sociology at Selby College, which is the AQA syllabus here. And your first year will be looking at family, education and theory and methods. Hello, I'm Emily and I'm one of the psychology teachers at Selby College. Some of the things that you will learn with me are things like um, approaches in psychology and different ways we can investigate behaviour, as well as understanding how human relationships work and also aggressive behaviour. Hi, I'm Lorraine. Welcome to Psychology. So there's a number of different things that I will be teaching you, um, such as social influence. Why do we obey other human beings? Memory. Why do we remember some things but not others? Attachment. Do we love our parents or is it because they feed us? Um, I think what else do we teach? What else do we teach? Schizophrenia. Yes, we do teach schizophrenia. And also um, psychopathology, which looks at things like OCD, depression and phobias. Hello, my name's Shelley. I am the course leader for A Level English Language. Um, the, the awarding body for this is AQA. It is very, very different to GCSE. It's not like anything you will have studied before. Uh, in the first year, we start del delving into linguistics, which is the scientific study behind words. We look at topics such as language and gender, social linguistics, how we interact with each other why we use the language we do, why it's interesting and we come forward to today where we see how we learn new words, where they come from, how they're coined and blended. Um, it's a really varied and interesting course. You have a 20% coursework which will be a language investigation of your choice so you get a lot of leeway in which subject you want to do your investigation on and you also get to do some original writing which could be um, a story, it could be um, absolutely anything you want it to be. Um, so there's a lot of scope if you actually like to do original writing as well. It's a great course, come and join us. Hi, I'm Kerry, I teach English Literature at College. Uh, we study AQA, it's a two year course, uh, two exams at the end and you do a piece of coursework as well. Uh, a bit different to GCSE, there is overlap but uh, we do it in a different way in college, so you can expect lots of group work, lots of paired activities, lots of research and that kind of thing. Uh, in the first year we look at tragedy, um, we do a play, uh, we do some poems and we also do some Shakespeare, so it's worth knowing about that. The second year of the course we do uh, social protests, so we look at how people deal with political issues, um, ideas like rebellion and censorship and politics and how they do that in uh, novels. Uh, we also look at some unseen work and um, the coursework is something that you get a lot of flexibility to choose what you want to do. So you will choose texts that matter to you and you will write about those and that will make up 20% of your overall A-level. Hello, I'm Alan and I'm here to tell you something about the History A-level at Selby College. It's a two-year programme, three examined modules, one piece of coursework which accounts for 20% of the A-level. In the first year, you will study the history of Germany uh, from the end of the First World War to the end of the Cold War. You will then study the history of Italy, particularly fascist Italy, 
between 1911 and 1945. In the second year, you will look at the British experience of warfare, which covers four wars, uh, the Crimean War, the Boer War, the Napoleonic Wars, the First World War. Uh, overall, it's a very exciting course with a lot of relevance to today. We've also in the past done several European tours to Germany and Poland, and hopefully we'll be able to do that again once the current pandemic crisis is over. We hope you join us in September and enjoy your studies with us. Action. Hi, my name's Karen. I'm the Geography Lecturer here at the College. Um, when you first start with us in September, we will be doing the Edexcel Geography course. Uh, in the first year, you'll be doing plate tectonics. Uh, we then start and then we look at coasts. Both of those are quite similar to what you will have done at GCSE. You're just sort of building on your knowledge. We then start to look at the human paper, which is globalisation and then regenerating places, which again, you'll have got links with, with the, the GCSE content that you've probably already covered. In year two, that is when you'll start to do some new geography. Um, and we look at um, the water cycle and all of the issues with global warming that are affecting the water cycle, um, the carbon cycle and all of the causes of global warming. Um, and then we go on to look at superpower geography and health and human rights. The exam is 80% of your final um, mark and then you've got 20% coursework you will, where you will do a geographical investigation. In the past we have done um, trips to Iceland um, and local fieldwork opportunities which after everything that's calmed down with COVID, we will hope to start again.